Emma, what day is it? It is badminton. Going to badminton day. I was kind of anticlimactic it there, Emma. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> I'm very excited though. I like the sunglasses. Um, I know, well, it's very sunny. It's lovely weather this morning. So I know, look at this. Making the most of it. And we're actually going to be leaving in 15 minutes. And Emma's got the purple shampoo up. Yeah, and I'm starting bathing, so. Oh. Okay, so like Emma said, going to badminton today. If you watched our last video, then you'll know that the lorry is all packed up and ready to go. So it's about a four hour journey, which I mean, honestly for us is quite normal for eventing. Like we've gone a lot further for championships, but yeah, not too far. Emma's washing Piper. Yeah, a bit late as per usual, but I mean, it's fine because she's actually not doing dressage until five o'clock tomorrow. But she's got a course walk that she wants to go on tonight, as well as a lesson with her instructor. So that's why we're going up today. Also, it'll give a chance for her to ride Piper a few times. So he hopefully isn't too excited. Um, whether he'll still be able to contain himself in the dressage. So I'm just beating up now. Yay! Yeah. <laughs> Bought some new travel boots for Piper. To match his rug, of course, which he isn't wearing because it's too hot, but. You look like you're out of Top Gun, Emma. I am. Do you like Top Gun glasses? I am. I need the ball. Come on, Puppy. Move those back legs. <laughs> Emma. Nothing like being dramatic, is there? They're quite heavy, they're tight. So we're all loaded and ready to go to badminton. Rock and roll. I think they gathered that we're going to badminton. Up. <laughs> Rock and roll. Yeah, no, but I've got to, I've got to right, say about ten million times. Yeah. Bye, Emma. We're currently out of services, refueling. Five in the back. Getting impatient. Yep. So we're currently stopped at a service station, as Emma would have said. Got my coffee. So we're going for like just over three hours now. So we must be nearly there. We've got like an hour left. Emma's back there. What coffee did you get? Nice camel mac. Nice latte. And a donut. So. We'll see you when we get there. They went over a little bright white thing that you can see on the ground out there. Nope. With all the ponies that they're a lot fancier than Mr. Bipey. Yeah. We're not in this one. I don't think it's this one. <laughs> We're in the wrong stable. Great. <laughs> you told me it was the middle one, Emma.
It's tea time! Oh, just sell the. Who wants tea? Um, We've got some serious lunch and tea making going on behind us. Right, Mother, that one's yours. Do you want it? Do you? Hand. <laughs> oh, he looks so angry. So we've all arrived and settled in, and I'm about to go and have a bit of a just last lesson on Piper. On her lesson and Piper's feeling really good. A little bit head flicky um, but that may have been due to slightly down to the flies. Um, but yeah it's feeling really really good actually. Look relaxed for tomorrow. Yeah look very relaxed so in a second he's gonna go and have his massage with by Abby of course oh, yeah. so we had to point to herself. <laughs> Not so you can't do your own massage can you? <laughs> no Piper has a massage from Abby so yeah you'll enjoy that. Um, yeah. Gonna ride him again tomorrow morning? Um, Maybe. Maybe I'll ride it again for one morning or I just go after one. <gasps> Too many treats! <laughs> Those are going to be really annoying. <laughs> Big leg. Where's the camera Emma's painting the pony. Oh. I don't think I've made How's it going? The last leg. Last leg. Well, literally, last look looks. at this the difference between on and off. You actually yeah, can't really see on the camera. Up, but like look at this. White. So, you put this on overnight and take it off tomorrow, <laughs> and then I'll put some more on tomorrow as well. It's just got a little white patch, it won't look like that tomorrow. No pressure, Emma. Concentration, don't screw it up. Hi, yeah, like well. Great! You got scissors as well? Yeah. Oh, Pipe's going to annoy every other horse in here. So, now I'm just making Pipe's feed up for the evening and tomorrow morning. This is heavy. Lots of energy in there. And then uh, he's also got this like red it's blood milk. cell suck. I know what that is. That's I can smell it. That's what it smells. It's, it's a race six. horse. Um, what do they call it? It's a pump, isn't it? Yeah, they give to race horses. Instant energy or anything like that. Oh no, no, he's not allowed that. <laughs> he's not allowed After instant energy yet. Yeah. Yeah. Lark Hill with my stuff. I think Emma, you should be having that though. Yeah. 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 So Piper's all fed up and ready for the night and we'll see you guys tomorrow morning. <laughs> He's backed himself into the corner. Night Piper. Okay, so it is the morning now. Yeah, it is blooming freezing this Freezing. Morning. Went and got a coffee because I need a hand warmer. And now we're going to go down walk the cross country. Your dressage isn't until like five o'clock, so we've got quite a bit of time today to yeah. just. Oh my god, my coffee just spilled on my hand. <laughs> Abby, maybe you should come straight coffee. May maybe I should. Maybe I'll put the camera down. <laughs> Long walk. Alright, so we're about to go and walk the Cross Country bus. I've got my Cross Country app here to go and walk me through the minute markers. And um, let's go. And we have a nice little log for the first jump with a nice tree. A 
it's number two. This one looks nice, doesn't it? Table. Colour. Yeah, that hundred's quite big for a second jump. Third jump and first combination quite early on. Quite nice. Though. To a little brush. So Emma has another nice uh, log and the meter of this absolutely terrifying tricana. Guys, I'm five foot seven. Five foot eight. It's next to the big scary five star jump. Not sure Buck would be a fan. It's quite pretty. That would make some nice photos. Yeah, until you're supposed to stick to it. We'll get stuck that would also there. make some cool photos. See, on a really, very full so jump that. To be fair, if you're on a five star horse, that should be... That should be nice. Well, it's the only second job, isn't it? Here we have... Road, it looks exactly like the one we practised at home, doesn't it, Emma? Exactly. Nice two out as well. Quite nice. And another big, scary five star jump. Solar panel jumps, like the five star ones. I guys, about them on guys they're plastic, today. don't worry. I they're saw, not glass. I saw it. Two, number two. First look of the house, Emma. Very nice. And now, in a minute, we're going to be all the way over there. You excited? <laughs> Absolutely thrilled to walk up that hill. Oh, I know. Emma's off. We should probably keep up. So, this log, we come out quite wide to it. Old five star jump. Behind the balance, leg on. And then on landing, as we're going down the hill, we take a couple of checks so they don't run on too quickly. And then when we're down the bottom, check a bit more, getting back on his hocks, and then hopefully do a nice turn once I've got the rhythm back and the canter. Go and pop over that double. Come wide. Right I'm gonna out walk into a tree. tree. Yeah. And this one. These are actually quite big, aren't they? Yeah. That hundred one mean. I know, I That's nasty. The old five star jumps again. Um They are quite big. M is five foot seven, so that's for okay. reference. They are meaty. But I think they'll jump nicely. Not too skinny, so then up to number B. <laughs> Letter B. Don't go that way. Through the flags. Through the flags. What's your thoughts on the course so far, Emma? Uh, what are we fence now? Fence eleven. That was eleven. Um, well, that last combination is fairly tricky. Then we have a nice, frangible rail, which should be. Bit of a speed bump for him if he gets a bit excited after that. Get a nice jump over that. And pick up a bit of speed, Emma, to make it up the hill. We need a bit of momentum oh, yeah. here. That is true. They've got quite a sharp turn though, haven't they? There's some food vans there. I think Piper's going to want to stop for some waffles. Yeah, a <laughs> quick break. I'll stop for a and Well, we've got to walk up a hill now, so we'll see you guys at the top. But we have a um, nice hay cart here. And now we're on to another question. So this is our corner job that we practiced. Do to not take up too much of an angle. Over there. Starting up right gate, coming up the corner. The corner's nice because then you can give you a bit of a curve to set up for this one. And then inside that white cut thing, the B element. Take the inside to be the lake, Emma. Riding Badminton Lake. Emma's trying out the wellies. She's going swimming. Off you go, Megan. No, there might be fish. I think you're safe. I don't think you're going to get eaten by fish, Emma. No, it's quite deep. Okay, I got worried though, because I saw this TikTok the other day about someone just walking through like shallow water and then get like eaten by an anaconda. It was. Well, I don't think there's any anacondas in Babbitt Lake. I think it you're wasn't safe. Movie, but still, we can't be never. It was a movie. Yeah, okay. Because it's not like the Babbitt Lake. It's like a little bit of a swim lake. Yeah, okay. Down the back. Two. Little shoulder brush in front of the house. Did you want to do that? 
there we go. Iconic Voltaire's jump. Lovely. In front of the house. The other side. Definitely need to get a photo here. It's very wide there. Last jump, Emma. Hopefully you make it this far. Hopefully. Fingers crossed. Quite a nice last jump though. Yeah. Very nice. Yep. And through the finish. Yay! Emma, what are your thoughts on the course? Looks difficult enough. Yeah, I think there's lots of like compounding questions. Yeah, a lot of questions. It can be quite exciting actually. Yeah. The ride. Yeah, I'm excited. It, I think it's definitely doable if you. You have to be on it, but there's nothing that's like. You can't do that. Mm, yeah. So hopefully, it should be okay. Yeah. Oh no, we've got to climb a gate, but then we're going to head back. You're going to ride? Yep, we're going to go and ride Pipe. I've practiced my warm up for plan for today. And then. I don't know. Maybe Pat up. Pat up at some point, maybe a bit later on. Yeah. We've got quite a lot of time. We'll probably watch a bit of dressage, maybe. Maybe not. Past that, take you to 22, which will give you, no, maybe a bit more than that. 25 past, maybe. Yeah, yeah, okay. But don't start to pick him up until, what, quarter two? And don't overstretch him either. Don't yes. get him too hot. Yeah, yeah, because he didn't do loads of stretching digs. What he did, he did really well, didn't he? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay. So look at this moon. Good luck. <laughs> I told her to get um extensions. Now we get to the actual passing because this stuff was a nightmare. <laughs> yeah. To be fair, you did quite a good job there. This is the best we're getting. I'm actually live on TikTok. And they're doing the tail plat. Concentration. Yeah, it's quite good so far actually. Let's see if these are as good. This one is being as redone. Good. These oh, they two. are quite good. That one, questionable. You know when toddlers have buns and they stick out the side of their head because they don't have enough hair? That's what it is. Yeah, that's what that reminds me of. He just has two that are just going to be really stupid. That one's almost alright. Almost. It's a side pepper. Well, there you're going to get stuck, mate. No. Oh, does he just want to go to sleep? <laughs> He is looking yeah, very clean. Very fancy. They're very clean legs. Oh, pipes. <laughs> Let's suppose. This is L. You are on six and four in this side. Thank you. Okay, you aren't going to get any cleaner. Well, you might, but he's not. <laughs> yeah. So Amazon and we're heading over to the dressage now. Fingers crossed it all goes well. You are the light when there is no sun. You are the rainbow when the rain is done. You are the wind that whistles my name.
I don't think I've seen him do one better than that. Very, very, we're very happy. Very good best pony. Best yeah, best PB. Maybe not PB school, we'll wait and see, but definitely PB test that he's done. Oh. Well, I would have to get a... <laughs> good time to do his best test. Yeah, that was a good one. That was good. Oh. We can ban him up tomorrow morning anyway. No, we no? can't. Okay. <laughs> Videos might have been They've a bit the, shaky. I was a bit. In, though, the well. I get a bit nervous, yeah. Emma. Just staying in for the central stuff. Platin or out? It's the brow band. Oh, yeah, um, the brow band is out. Well. And then Wait, platin again in the morning. Yeah. Do you want to go and grab his head collar from the locker? Yeah. So, dressage. <laughs> Not as smiley as earlier. No. Very, 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 very happy with the test I did. By far the best test I've done on Piper. It was I think that was the maximum Piper the could best ever do. We could possibly have done. Um, the walk was a bit hesitant, but <laughs> but. Uh, but the score. Big but. This is going to sound bad, guys, because it's not a bad score. It's not a bad score, but I've got I don't know, like twenty fives. I've got twenty one before on Piper. He can. He he should have been thirty or sub thirty. Um, but and he should have really been at least in the top 15 after that test um, and especially after seeing some of the tests because we've been watching tests all day that they've been doing and looking at the other horses on the scores that they got my p test compared to theirs it should have been way 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 higher unfortunately but um, I ended up getting a 32 to sit in around midfield um, going into the second day of dressage about 25th I think out of 55 um, which isn't horrendous and I know um, there's amazing people that have qualified for this and really 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 difficult to qualify for um, so it's all great people it's just but, a bit yeah, disappointing but disappointing but tomorrow's exciting another day tomorrow. bit less pressure yeah and we'll enjoy my drinks I'm going to have tonight welcome gonna be drinks an underdog come from the back yeah exactly. win from behind tomorrow yeah and I'll see you guys tomorrow. So Emma's on cross country doing her final course walk. So we're on Piper duty to get ready for show jumping on cross country today. So we've been accosted into being grooms. Well, she's meant to be the groom, and I'm more support. Yeah, I like actually that. am not doing a lot. I did mark out half of his stable <laughs> until she got distracted. Well, you were giving me very judgy looks. So she's like a professional groom, basically. <laughs> Technically. Almost. Yeah, like almost. She will be. Um, Don't look at these plaques though. Yeah, we'll look at the top ones. If Piper you're names. thinking about hiring her, look at those ones. Don't look at the bottom ones. How are they going? Give us an update. They're going all right. I mean, we've got these two little dodgy ones, which are inevitable, but other than that, they're okay. The yeah, top ones top are good. Oh gosh, I'm tired. Um, <laughs> and we haven't done the half beat yet. I know. Yeah, I've walked the show jumping and I re walked the country this morning. The show jumping's looking okay. Quite a few clears. I think it looks quite an average 90 from what I saw on my little yeah, wonder. Yeah, it looks fairly average. Not too horrific, but there's it's on a bit of a slope, which. And big crowds. Doesn't help. Big crowds, well, at the moment there's big crowds. We'll see if they're still big later on, but yeah. We'll see. Hopefully it all goes well. How long? What's the time? 12. There we go. And what time are you riding? 20 past 1. 20 past 1. It's okay. not long now. But the down Megan's this. reading. The reason the trash house test was the first one. <laughs> Could you do it? <laughs> energy drink time. Look at this. This is the sweetest. Raw it tastes like energy. you're drinking pure syrup. So let's see if that makes a difference. And Emma. I think when you see who's going to be more tired at the end, Piper or Emma? Definitely Emma. <laughs> oh yeah, no, us, because we have to <laughs> run to the end of this country. Oh, and up yeah. Okay, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to be like, motivational. <laughs>
Hold on, Emma. Go on, go on, go on baby. I wish I could explain your eyes and how the sound of your voice gives me butterflies. How your smile makes my heart skip a beat. How every time I'm with you, I feel so complete So complete You are the light when there is no sun You are the rainbow when the rain is done You are the wind that whistles my name So, as you can see, we're back from badminton. I'm currently being crushed by Piper. So I'm gonna do a little bit of a roundup about how everything went. So, dressage, Piper honestly, um, he warmed up a bit crazy and everyone was like, oh gosh, Emma's just gonna have to go in and survive this. But we actually managed to do probably the best test we've ever done. It was a pretty foot perfect test with no mistakes. But unfortunately, we only, I say only, but we got a 32, um, which kind of sat us around midfield. And I think the judges kind of just weren't that favourable of our test. And then show jumping on the next day, Piper decided that he was going to have his speedy pants on. His speedos. Yes, Piper. <laughs> and he was strong. And I think we took, we got two poles in that, but the first pole was just him getting a bit flat. I probably could have held him up a bit better. And then the second pole was him just not being so careful with his back end. Uh, and then cross country that we got to do after the show dumping was absolutely amazing. Piper was awesome. Unfortunately, um, the starters messed up the times a little bit. So I left the start box and then had to come back and we go out the start box again. So we're kind of on the back foot from the word go really. Um, and yeah, I was having to work quite hard 
around the first part of the course and then unfortunately we got a stop um, at some skinny brushes and I think I could have really have ridden him a lot better to them but at that point I was quite tired and maybe he could have helped me out slightly more but I came I gave him time after that to um, like chill out reset and I gave myself some time to just chill came back around slowly and then popped it rather nicely the second time we tried and then he proceeded to finish the rest of the course really really well and i'm so happy with him because the going was quite deep in that first half of the course and sticky i mean you saw it in the five yes yeah. the same thing yeah basically it was the same thing uh in the 90 a little bit and i was it wasn't first to go i was quite away through the class so the going didn't really suit him but he still tried so hard and i think it was oh that was a bite. <laughs> Overall, just so happy with um, Piper and how it went. And just being able to do su have such an amazing experience competing at badminton. And you never know, hopefully we'll be able to qualify again for it next year. So thank you so much for watching our um, video of badminton. We hope you enjoyed it. And see you again at the next event, which will actually be Abby at Pontuspool Cotswold Cup. So, and I'll hopefully be coming along and helping out and videoing there a little bit. So. It'll actually be me behind the camera. Well, in front, in front of, behind? In front. It'll be me in front of the camera next weekend, ah. guys, and Emma doing all the commentary from behind. Yeah. Roles reversed. Exactly. Bye, and see you guys again soon.